What's wrong? Can't sleep? Ah, you're thinking about silence. I almost feel like I get what she's doing, but not quite. Don't worry about that. I'm behind you and Liam till the very end. Don't you ever forget that. This is the first time I've told anyone this since I came to Felena. When I was a little younger than you are now, I made a terrible mistake in battle. Because of my arrogance and carelessness, I got caught off guard and took a blow to my left eye. Just when I thought I was done for, Farad saved me. I'm your ally because I owe Farad my life, and because I made a promise to your parents. But those aren't the only reasons. The biggest reason is because I've seen enough to know you're worth it. And everyone in this castle feels the same way. We're gonna win tomorrow. I'm sure of it. I'm sipping off the battle on the Daha tomorrow. Had been saying goodbye to the comfortable bed for a while. There's no one here. Royal Highness, you are most welcome to for observe for ritual. It's a tradition among the Dragon Cavalry to play the flute on the eve of major battles. It is most sacred ritual. We, the Dragon Cavalry, will, will do our best to honor your Royal Highness' presence. Sir Rook, Sir Raha, are you ready to commence the ritual? Indeed, Commander. You got it, Commander. Rania, you may play to your heart content tonight. You'll be in harmony with others, these are beautiful things. Come on, you run. Nick's no good. Show how about you join in. Ray, I love to. Ugh. Well then, Dragon Coffery, commence the ritual. version the music alone you know with that story it could make you cry that's how strong the music is so go then. And Sukodan 5 is always gonna be favorite Sukodans. It's the best Sukodans ever. And then Sukodan 2. And then Sukodan 3. Sukodan 1. They got in tactics. They got in four. I'm not talking about the DS and the and the PSP because it's in another world, you know, not a universe. The sun rune going berserk in ancient times? Hmm, doesn't ring a bell, young one, and I 
live a long, 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 long time. So if something like that had really happened, I would know, young one. But yes, young one. What? What's your name again? <laughs> Simon, if I don't remember something, that means it didn't happen. By the way, wait, young one. What am I doing here? Don't I live by a waterfall? Yeah, you remember nothing. So. Beautiful man, the music is. Prince, I had a talk with Urim. Frankly, I have my doubts about letting that nosy weasel join the Loyalist Army, but it seems like he's serious. I never should doubt that your judgment, Prince. Well, with Lady Lucerina keeping watch over Urim, you probably don't have too much to worry about. bear no grudge against Lady Silence, though I saw my father murdered right before my eyes. I finally understand what the House of Barrows has done. I have come to grasp the gravity of our sins. I wouldn't have been surprised if I had been killed too. I shall devote my life to your highness and hold no regrets. You know what the future's hold. All I can do is risk my life to ensure that your highness wins. I haven't been able to speak with my brother like this in years. How it all to you, your highness. Thank you so very much. Don't worry about my father, your highness. He got what he deserved. I'm just happy that Renwell was liberated. It's so sad for Lucerina, you know? The bed is empty. Oh, none. Muller is here. Not Wilhelm. Oh, Prince, how are you doing? Too bad a woman's bat is already closed, huh? Oh, I know, I know, say no more. No, no, twing wing. I mean, you like ladies too, after all. Catching a glimpse before the decisive battle sure would provide that extra motivation, eh? It's nice to catch a glimpse of that banging bodyguard. A bit. I love the music, man. It's so good. Commander Sula was frightened at 3D when he was about your ass. That's still attractive. He's no longer, though he's still attractive, he's no longer pretty. But I didn't play the loyalty to Sula's good look. I continue to serve him as long as I leave. Even after he ages into a wrinkled old prune. Still, I secretly wish he remained that pretty boy I once knew. You too will match her from pretty to attractive. Ah, what a shame. It's still like kids. Maybe fate will bring another pretty boy my way. When I said I want to join your side, it was merely an excuse for me to upset you firsthand. I wanted to see what kind of character you truly had, your highness. Don't take this the wrong way, but until recently, you were rather inconspicuous despite being the prince. But since this is common in Felena, it's a track a little tainted in armors. But you were invisible from the war's outset, and you even repulsed Commander Sparta invasion with no trouble. So you could imagine why I'd take an interest in meeting a man of your fine caliber. Had I not come, I would have regretted the very rest of my life have regretted the rest of my life. It was a truly wise decision. If Valena 
is to be in the hand of one such as you. Armors would be foolish to attack your nation. I am more sure of that. There is neither a more trustworthy ally nor fearsome fool than you, your highness. The all nation, Nagarea, the kingdom of Zelan, and the Scarlet Moon Empire have taken notice of you. I wouldn't be surprised if they send spies over to keep an eye of things if they haven't already. It seems that, you know, Kulug Empire already destroyed, or at least it already falls into Scarlet Moon Empire at this time. Kulug Empire is no more. Commander Sula is considering establishing friendly relations with Felina after the war. There may be some bad blood between our nation, but most people in armors don't wish to be enemies with Felina. Your Highness, please keep an open mind regarding this matter. Being that we are dealing with Your Highness, I am confident we have nothing to worry about. Your Highness must be victorious for there to be friendly relations between Felina and armors. We will do whatever we can to have your side win. This is not Armus. Why must a fashion diva such as myself come face to face with my fashion folk pass of a brother? It's absurd, incomprehensible, entirely disagreeable. I notice your little sister stick to you like glue. You should be careful. Little sister can feel sophisticated by all that attention. Especially if they fancy themselves as fish and divas. Uh huh, I was just speaking in fake generalities, of course. I wasn't referring to my situation in the least. This castle has become tiresome. It's constrained a fish and diva set as I. You of all people should know, simplistic thinking like Folgus doesn't cut in this day and age. Am I right? I'm right, right? And I get Folga to understand. Hey Prince, would you please tell him that Blaster's Oruk is a huge pain in the neck? He just never learns. Mechler end up like did like it did because that idiot Oruk too he was being so smart. I'm so sorry about the way they're acting, your highness. And after all that effort you put into getting Leckler back on his feet, I'm quite embarrassed by their behavior, but please don't let it get to you. They don't really mean it. Just ignore those two. That's just how they communicate with each other. You're gonna go back to the Sun Palace when the war's over, aren't you? Hmm? Gavin and Roy both look real mad. I told them they should try to get along before the final battle. And Roy get all mad at me, you know what he said? He said, don't say it, it's the last battle, it's not like we're gonna die or anything. I think they just stress out or something. Actually, I'm all stressed too. Damn, Roy, he never thinks about other people's feeling. Hey, what the hell? You come to laugh at me or what? Well, whatever. Something never changes. You just laugh at me more if I keep ripping on you. But it'd be too easy if you were happy with me. Forget about me. We're gonna go out and win tomorrow. For Felena, but mostly for the sweetie. Roy's really in love with Leon. And I think it should be, you know. Prince should be with Lucerina. <laughs> Sorry, Prince. I want to chat with Ernest tonight. Alone. I've been looking forward to this full moon for a long time. A very long, long time. Levi actually understood. He's a crazy old coot, but he's not a bad guy. Why do I look like this tonight? 
The power of the rune weakens on nights when the moon is full. Only then can I remain in human form. I would like to have a long chat with you too, Prince, but you'll have to excuse me. I ask that you let me spend this precious time with Norma. I'm so happy I could spend my time with Norma in this form before the final battle. Wawan thinks quite highly of you. It's the first time I heard that a crochy old geezer compliment anyone. It doesn't even compliment dwarfs, let alone humans. We dwarfs are the selfish lot. We probably wouldn't have joined your cause if it's not for our own interests. We gotta keep an eye on our manfolk, otherwise all they do is dig dig dig. But I'm gonna keep them in line, you just concentrate on being the supreme commander, human. Yes, today the last day of my blacksmith work here. Can't help but feel a little sad. Yes, today the last day. Could never say this in front of Master Laffy. Laffy. But uh, I want to do some really crazy magic myself without any help from him. But I wasn't born in the right body for that. How come dwarves aren't any good at magic, Prince? Robin went over to that old rafflet human place. He said it was a gathering of old timers. This is Robin first visited the human home. Well, willingly. We dwarf will try to get along better with humans and beaver from now on. It's been completely quiet south of Sable. It would appear that the Amazotan mountain corps have cheese hostilities just as Sula said. We should have no problem focusing on Solflina now. Rodra will also say your highness need not worry about Sable. He will help out as much as he can. But Slory Sobel is not here, but we have General Dean, the best of the best in Sable. And the song with the flute, it keeps coming, it keeps refreshing us. As a swordsman, I shouldn't be saying this, but I did task war. It makes me realize that swordsmanship is nothing more than the art of killing. Still, when war is inevitable, a swordsman's duty is to shed blood in the place of the hopeless masses. That's why we must hone our skill and push ourselves further than others. At least that's how I justify it. Forgive me, my leech. You need not tolerate such Indian rambling from one of your servants. Whatever happened, I wish to cross sword with Balkuts once more. Isn't it great now that the gladiators are free? I've achieved what I came back to Felina to do. Still, I have mixed emotion about dismantling the gladiator system through war. Many have already suffered great misery, but now they're being forced to sacrifice even more. The end has yet to come, I'll keep fighting until it does. Is Hazuki all over Belkut again tonight? Yeah, like I said before, she's not afraid about Hazuki fighting Balkut, she's afraid with Hazuki all over Balkut. Like the crazy Hazuki. Yes. Yeah, we explore all of it. It's time to get to Ras. All the event is triggered. time for us to sleep and go to war. Highness, will you be turning in for the evening? Yes, as you wish. Pleasant dream, your highness. No one has taken up your offer to leave the castle, my lady. Really? I must say that I'm impressed. The Sun Rune hasn't been used in any of the battles this far. It seems everyone believes that only a legitimate queen of Felina can use it. Some say they're more worried about the Twilight Rune. Runes aren't the problem. Lady Silent is. I'm worried that he might be playing right into her hands. I'm 
I'm worried that we might be playing right into her hands. What do you mean, my lady? Oh, nothing. Lily, we should both start getting some rest soon. We wouldn't want to start botching crucial decisions just because we're fatigued. Understood. But you wouldn't mind staying up just a little longer, would you, my lady? 